So we're here at the Merlin booth, and who are you? Hello, this is Peter Curtis. I'm representing Leonardo here at Merlin booth. Leonardo is a 3D uh, virtual reality kit, the smallest VR kit in the market. It's a desktop one, so you can connect it with your laptop or PC. You just need a 3D screen. What do you have in the kit? In the kit, we have uh, head tracking, 3D glasses, so you can even look behind the pop-out object. Whoa. We have a, a device, it's called Bird, because of the shape. So it's a 3D mouse with a haptic Whoa. feedback. So when you touch an object in the 3D environment, there's a vibrating engine, so you will always know when you touch it. And you can use the whole space in front of the monitor. We also have three uh, IR uh, uh, sensors here. Everything connected with the sensors of the bird and the embedded sensors of the glasses. It's beautiful. So it's a small VR kit. Yeah. Is this is this uh, in mass production? Is totally available? Yeah, it's available, and uh, you can you can import any kind of 3D file type. You can import. Uh, so you're not touching the screen. You're. I'm not touching the screen. Yeah. Because all the sensors are uh, connecting together uh, uh, with, the, with the device. And what you create here, it can be printed out with a 3D printer. I can even import uh, uh, engineering uh, product like this uh, metro station here. So I can even have a 3D presentation for more than 50 people just connecting with a 3D projector or a, or a, a big stream 3D TV. Uh, what I can what I can do I can scan myself I can import a file here and I can print out with a 3d printer Is like this, this one hey, it's my CEO but, uh, the CEO. Yeah. Yeah. we just created a mask body <laughs> He's for the him. Hulk. <laughs> he we just created this mask body for him yeah but uh, so how or do you, you scan how do you scan yourself how does that work there you can are, scan uh, yourself 3D with scanners not, not with, with your this, but there are available 3d scanners on the market it's not some cheap, cheap ones no? there are some cheap ones as well yeah. so you can 3d scan your face import a file here creating a body and then print out with any kind of printer. So Different is... materials, even ceramic, if you have a printer like this. So you can have your morning coffee cup or a short cup. So yeah. where are you from? I'm, from? I'm based in Europe, Budapest, Hungary. Yeah, and we are a partner company together. Where, with where's the headquarters? Headquarters there, in, in Hungary, Budapest, and yeah, with so, this product. So how much is this kit? This kit comes, uh, there are a professional kit coming for 2,000 US dollar. Here at the show we are giving for 1,000. 1,000 dollar, yeah. you get the whole kit here? The whole kit, all the software, the conference software, uh, the, the, the 3D manipulation software, and also we are giving an SDK, a software development kit, so you can create compatibility with different software, like Unity Game Engine. This is a welding training solution made by a French company, GeoGebra. Uh, it's a math-based uh, education solution. Those are the guys from the University of Iowa. Uh, they are teaching uh, 3D design classes. A lot of references. Two years ago, we won the best, the best prize at the CES show in Las Vegas. All right. They've been seen at the ABC News. So, so how many yeah. people buy this so far? Yeah, we are more than 55 distributors worldwide, so quite popular. Quite so popular. that's why it's the smallest and cheapest available 3D VR kit on the market. So you say it's very easy to use making? for making 3D objects. It's not, it's not the game. What is? It's not, it's just it's not a game. No, it's a 3D yeah. edi editing tool. So you see a pop-out image. You can edit the object in 3D, and you can print out to the printer. So do people use that to create games or no? Yeah, for games as well. So, so you there can, are some game creators who have this. Yeah, yeah. We have an open API, so uh, any programmers with uh, programming skills can create compatibility with 3D games as well. So it's available for uh, creating 3D games. What's the next kind of product you're going to do in the future? Uh, we are working on a wireless model because it's wired. So we have the prototype. So hopefully next year we will do that. And right now we have Leopoli. It's an online uh, database of 3D objects, more than 10,000 objects. It's a cloud-based platform. You can go online, you can choose an object, further manipulate it to your home, and then print it out, or online print it. If you don't have a printer, you can just send it to an online printing company, and they will post it to you, send it to you. Like this uh, cap, because it's made by ceramic. So you can choose even uh, an object made by silver, brass, and so on. Did you participate in many uh, 3D printing conferences and stuff like that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. What Each do people month, say? Yeah, people like it. And uh, most of our distributors, they are 3D printer distributors, because they can sell it as a package together with a 3D printer. Because it's a, a really easy uh, way uh, how to create the objects, how to manipulate 3D objects which can be printed out.